are on episode three of season two of The Walking Dead. We just lost Rebecca. We got Arvo. We're supposed to be going to his area. And it's, as you can see, it's snowing. I thought it, that my choices changing was going to save Rebecca by giving her the medications. But at the end of the day, she still lost too much blood. And at the end of the day, the same fight broke out with Arvo. So either way it went, we still were going to have to fight them. You know what I'm saying? So, I thought it was going to make a big difference, but it didn't. So, hell, yeah. glad I got the pills, you know what I'm saying? She took some oxy, had the baby just fine. She just bled too much, man. Is that it? Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? it? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us! Arvo, we're not trying to be mean to you. We just want to know if this is where the supplies are. Is this the place you're taking us? Are the supplies here? No, it's at the house. It's still more work. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen! This guy fucked us! Uh, thank you. Don't mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit! Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking nowhere. I think we should spend the night here, if it's safe. That's a big if. Well, there's a fence, which would help with walkers. Maybe. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. No, that's all you. Shh, it's okay. It's okay. You're a natural. I think he likes you. Calmed right down for you. That's a good sign. He's cute. Yeah, he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Here, I got them. Damn. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Not a weird little alien. Today's my birthday. Near as I can tell, at least. Happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Thanks. So, that makes you... what? 27? That's... that's right. I'm surprised you remembered. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure there's some asshole sitting on that paperwork, waiting to collect. Probably. What did you study? Majored in art history. That's cool. <laughs> Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop it. You get a minor in agriculture. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. Was saving it for a special occasion, and while it being your birthday and all, figure this is as good a time as any.
feel a little guilty taking the first Whoa, uh... wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the, uh... Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. A toast means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> to the loved ones that we've lost along the way. To and to the hope that we see them again. The someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah? I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. I can take it. Nah, you stay warm. Clem, let him go. I'm gonna post up over near the hole in the fence there. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. Fire's real nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Maybe in a bit. Oh, I think it will blow I up. I didn't expect her to come back. Home. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just... don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about her. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey! Alright, All right. it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. It's my fault for bringing it up. Don't look at me, me, none of this. Maybe she came back for you. Could be. I don't know what to say to that. Me either. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we learned something. Yeah? Well, what's that? Luke's a regular Casanova. Hey, shut up. Yes, don't be modest. Well, well. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Worked on me. Oh, shit. I just did it too, didn't I? Sorry. It's the drink talking. They say a drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. Come on, Jamie Painty. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? That depends. What is it? It's rum? Probably. Hey, bro. I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to, you know. Only if you make it weird. weird. If you make it weird, just be cool, hang out. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. What's up? Why does this feel set, like I'm bro? signing a contract or something? We're not digging it. That's really good. Have you had any? You want to sip? It's okay. No, thanks. I'm trying to cut back. <laughs> you can be the designated driver, then. Cool. But I don't know how to drive, though. It's easier now. There aren't any cops. 
but... I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? It was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces. Sounds like a mess. Yeah, it was. Every couple years, someone would step on a piece of glass that didn't get swept up and get mad at me all over again. The problem with glass is, it looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. You ate glass? I ate glass. I haven't thought about that in a long time. I guess a deal's a deal. Here. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Dang, bro, why you sound like that? That's not the fire or something like that. Wanna sit here? No, that's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. Some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there after Sarita was. I just. I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Koch's face. Anything in the world. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. Hey, thanks for sticking by me. I know I ain't made it easy sometimes. You haven't. <laughs> Jane. You don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. 
But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. All right, enough of that. Hey, you Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Oh, he found his, his bullet hole patched up. Yeah, yeah, all right. Look, he could use it. Leave me alone! Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't Leave have... me alone! <laughs> Damn. Stop! Jesus, Kenny! You knocked the kid out! What was I supposed to do? He was screaming bloody murder! What the hell did you rile him up for? He was tied up. So? What's that got to do with anything? It was under control. You knocked him out with a gun. I was just reacting. I, I didn't have time to... Fuck! You're tired, Kenny. Maybe you should get some rest. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I could probably use some sleep. It's been a long day. We should rest up. That kid was defenseless. I know, I know. But we can't do nothing about that now. Let's just get a little rest. Will you take first watch? I mean, I can if you don't All want right. to. Come on, Kenny. Let's go get some sleep. Okay. Yeah. Everybody rest up. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow. Kenny is getting a little reckless, though. You sure you're good? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think you're full of shit. It can't be much further. Behind you! What the fuck? Jesus Christ! That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere! That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not gonna think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Are we just gonna walk over? Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out. Just to be safe. Less weight the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay.
for Rusky. Rusky. You don't want to say Russian, but Rusky. We're okay. Don't worry. Who's gonna fall in here? That shit. We got some walkers behind us. That's only a few of them. We should be all right. Let's just get to the house. Hey, stay with us. Fuck. Oh, Cow better run. That's two less to deal with. Well, just stay spread out, and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Uh, Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't hurt him! Well, they made it. Fucking run, Luke. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. Oh shit. You got walkers on the way. Let me help it's too you. Too thin for both of us. I just I just gotta be careful. Oh! Luke, no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine. I'm fine. No, you're not. I just gotta pull myself out. You need help, Luke. The ice is too thin. I got it. You need to help. No! Clem, go! You're gonna fall through! Go help no, him! No, Clem, Clem, do not! just go back for him! You're light! You, you Stop can do it! Stop telling her that! Clem, look at me! Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Clem, you can make it, but you need to go! Thanks! Thanks! I'll be on a sec, just... just keep shooting! not gonna make I, it! My, my, my leg! It's, I just Hold need on, him. I got you. Rest a second. Uh, keep him off us, Clem. No, no, it's too much. Too Shut much up. weight. Shut the fuck up. Go back. I can save you. I gotta you. get us both killed. Come on. Stop. I got you. Stupid. Too late. Clementine, stop! Nothing more you can do. I got you. No. I got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're gonna be okay. Go. To the house. We need a fire. Oh, fuck. She's gonna fucking freeze to death. So he was gonna die either way it went. Nigga needs to pull. How'd how she hold How the fuck did that happen? There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. We have to get them warm. They're gonna freeze to death. He's just gone. Luke's fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. It happened too fast. I said I started to go. There wasn't nothing any of us could do. You could have. 
You could have helped him. Don't listen to her, Clem. This ain't on you. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny! Don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault! The hell it ain't! <sighs> I'm freezing. Can we just get a fire started? Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You fucking commie piece of shit! Get Kenny! Fuck you! So we ain't getting up fire, huh? Mother! What the fuck, Kenny? Kenny! Stop it! He ain't even want you, Bonnie. You wanna say it's my fault, bitch. You wanna know how much shit y'all keep trying to put on me? What did you do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. You wanna tell me how a can of fucking chili is gonna help How is beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. So y'all placing blame on each other. Nigga, I need to get the fuck away from I'm mom, tying y'all. him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? These hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. You got a light? I thought I had matches. You kept it. He would have been good for Sarah. Sarah would have been his little boyfriend. I mean, girlfriend. Let me take a look at you, kid. Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up and be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him.
Clem. Just be careful. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Come on. Let's see if the truck's going to go. My daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch. But he taught me respect. Girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. We're all just tired. Hell. I've been tired for two years. All right, give it a turn. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now those rumors can't all be bunk. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? I've never been there. I went once, long time ago, just before I met Cap. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Damn. Kenny needs something to believe in. Wish they'd finished this place. What do you want? I just wanted to see how you were. <sighs> how do you think? Did he ain't want you. It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. You and I both know what happened back there. I got nothing more to say to you. All right, babe. You get mad because he ain't want you. All right. It is what it is. I got nothing to say to you. He had his eyes on somebody else. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! I've seen that look before. Son of a bitch! He'll be fine. Clem, he beat that boy within an inch of his life. 
We are way past fine. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. But then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Seems like you've done that before. You wanna try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <coughs> it puked. It puked. Gross. <laughs> There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. They had to try, right? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. He got it working. It works? What'd I tell you? So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man, this is fucking nuts. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. We have to bring him with us. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! I ain't finna say that. That's all.
You better talk some sense into him. For wow. his sake. Why wow, always gotta talk sense into him for his sake? What you finna do, bro? Like, like, put it on out there, mate. God damn it! That stupid fucking... Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry, just... Give me a second. Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. They're scared of you, Kenny. Well, if their big plan is to wander around in the woods, they ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. What you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. And... To keep my hair short. <laughs> we can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit. But where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? I think she you know... Did. When I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when well, you sat down up. next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. I, I felt pride, a pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. Yeah, but... We can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. So we gotta be ready. Hmm. I'm gonna pause it right there and get back on it in a minute.